Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is another Waste or Worth It Wednesday. And today I wanted to show you or talk to you about the Too Faced Born This Way foundation. Now I know that this is not like super new. I mean it is fairly new but it's not like yesterday new. But I've been seeing so many people raving about this foundation and how you need it in your life and I use me all these magnificent things so i decided to just you know get it and try it out for myself so i went and looked for um this foundation and let me just say off the bat that it was so easy to get color match which was just a nice and pleasant experience as always i'm first going to start off with the product itself um move on to the demo and then give you my final opinion so this is what the packaging looks like Too Faced is known for really cute packaging it's just pink with gold and black which gold and black is one of my favorite colors as far as like design now i'm just going to read you what it says on the back on the backs on the box it says oil free undetectable medium to full coverage foundation and then it says again infused with coconut water to delicately replenish skin's moisture levels alpine rose to brighten skin's appearance and promote elasticity and hyaluronic acid for a smoother more youthful appearance it says coverage so undetectable and skin so naturally radiant they'll think you were born this way honey so because i've heard so many good things about it like i said i was just really eager to try it i promised myself that i wasn't going to buy any foundations just because i have so many that i really don't feel the need to buy more but i just i couldn't resist and i just had to get it so this is what the packaging looks like and i absolutely love it i think it's one of my favorites like foundations as far as packaging goes it's just really cute and it's it's really like elegant almost another thing that i like is that it comes with a pump which is just a plus for any you know person that wears foundation because if you don't have a pump and you just put it on the back of your hand sometimes you just put on too much and then you just pretty much end up throwing it away so i really appreciate that they took the time to put a pump on this foundation now the retail value for this foundation is 39 dollars. i actually got mine at ulta because when it comes to foundations i'm not the biggest fan of ordering ordering them online just because i always find that i either get it too dark or too light so i just wanted to go in and have them color match me so now i'm just gonna go ahead and move on to the demo i'm gonna show you how i apply it my favorite way of applying it is with a beauty sponge either with a beauty blender or the real techniques um sponge it's just whatever you have but sponges for me just do it the best i feel like i get the most coverage and the most natural um, foundation on my skin so i'm going to go ahead and show you how it looks and then we can move on to see if this product is waste or if it's totally worth it so this is the Too Faced born this way um foundation so i'm going to take about a full pump so i'm just going to place this on my skin this is actually a lot of foundation for me i don't like to cake on my foundation just because i'm oily and i feel like it just it looks nasty on me when I apply too much. I'm going to take a damp beauty blender. This is by Real Techniques and I'm just going to push in that foundation into the skin. So this is what the foundation looks like with no concealer, no bronzer, no anything. Let me just bring you guys up close. It looks really flawless and it really feels like I'm not wearing anything. Okay, so as you guys saw on the demo, this foundation literally feels and looks like there's nothing on your skin. I don't think I've ever come across a foundation 
as amazing as this one. I really like my NARS All Day Luminous Weightless Foundation or whatever it's called. I love that one. But I just think I love this a little bit more. It does everything that it says it's going to do. It does um, give you medium to full coverage. I usually don't like to have caked on foundation. If I do need extra coverage, then I do go back and just apply it to the spots where I need, you know, that extra little coverage, like I said. And I feel like this doesn't cake up on me. Now, the only thing that I do have to say about this foundation is that it's not... It's not going to keep you matte. I don't know if it says what kind of finish it has. Um, let me see. I don't think it says, you know, whether it's like that matte finish or anything like that. For me, I do have to touch up right around here, here, and that's about it. Because that's where I get the most oil for me. Um, I usually carry like little blotting sheets or just um, some translucent powder and I just you know pretty much blot away any oil that I have. I don't get excessively oily and this kind of like controls it but it's I can still see my oil peeking through so it's not the best for oily skin but it's not to the point where it's like super like you know like slipping all over my face so I don't mind it. I really, really like this foundation. Like I said, I really don't have anything bad to say about it. It's very long wearing on myself, even with oily skin. I feel like I get at least six hours out of it. And it just photographs so nicely. I almost don't even need to touch up my pictures when I'm wearing this foundation because it just seems like I have absolutely flawless skin. And I do have large pores around here. And this just covers everything to the max. So I absolutely love this foundation. I think if you are willing to spend $30, $40 on this foundation, you should definitely get it. Um, Too Faced definitely just blew me out of the waters with this because it's such a good foundation. Literally, if I had to throw away all my foundations and I had to keep just one, I would have to say this. This is just a staple for me from now on and I just love it. So with that being said, I totally think that this foundation is worth your money. I don't think it's a waste. If you haven't tried it, you really, really should. Even if you get a sample, that's what I did at first. I got a sample and then I just fell in love with it and went and purchased the full size bottle. You can get samples at um, Ulta or Sephora, I believe as well. And it's just, just try it out and you will see what I'm talking about. You will fall in love with this foundation. So that is everything for today's Waste or Worth It Wednesdays video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. I know that this foundation is blowing up all around the internet but I just wanted to give my little two cents here and let you guys know how it works with my oily skin so let me know if you guys have this foundation if you've tried it if you love it or if you hate it leave me your comments down below and also I wanted to let you guys know that I did film a look on this makeup tutorial so it will be up sometime either Friday or next week so stay tuned for that so that is everything for today's video Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't. And I'll see you guys in my next video.